I smell a campfire on the wind. To the north. If we head upriver, we can find it and make camp. Uh, Liam? How much further do you think it is to the campsite? Not far. Can you smell it in the breeze? Uh, yeah. Yeah, sh sure I can. Are you hurting that bad? No, no. I'm fine. Entirely fine. Sophia, I'm worried about you. I told you I'm fine, Liam. Saying you are and being is different things. Oh, nothing's the matter. <coughs> I just wanted to tell you. I hope you know that I love you. I know, Liam, and I love you too. This adventure's got me thinking about the first time we ever met. Do you remember? I could never forget that look on your face. But I do love to hear you tell the story. Remind me? You thought you were so clever, hidden beneath the table in Albert's shop. You always did provide such a haven for us, Dibbins. You jumped out to scare me as I walked in, dressed in the most outrageous outfit, no less. All the better to startle Fraby with. But it wasn't Fraby, it was you. The loveliest little mouse divin I'd ever laid eyes on. You laughed at my absurd get-up. I've been trying to make you laugh again ever since. Goodness, how old were we? Just tiny dibbins we must have been. <laughs> I can't believe you were fawning over me all those years before you even said a word. I? How could I not? Oh, Alright. Uh, let's see. That's a lot. Wow. Hmm. Well, we can't go here. We will drown. Well, you, um... Ah, you hurried over there, okay. That does not sound too good. <clears throat> oh, we're gonna have to push this on the ice, I'm pretty, pretty sure. Oh, it doesn't have the um, grabbing animation now. Still. Ah, jam over there. I'm not gonna be like overly looking for it, but if I can find it, I will go for it. Maybe not the best idea when it's icy. Sure, I could nail it, but you know, we just take a look around first, though. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I can nail it. Yeah. Ah, oh, there she is. Do it. 
There we go. Oh, come on. I should probably talk to her. But... Sophia, I can't stand to hear you in pain any longer. What can I do to help? Liam, I, I can't keep scurrying around like you are. And maybe there's another way. Uh, you could go on ahead and find a better path. What? I can't! What if the rats find you? We don't have a choice, Liam. Scout ahead like the wondrous scout you are. Find a smooth path. <clears throat> then come back and lead me through it. Um, uh, uh, perhaps I could be of assistance? Huh? Who's that? Reveal yourself! My, my. I, I beg your pardon, young scout. Albert. I ah. have no intention of alarming you. Albert? What in the name of Martin are you doing all the way out here? I fled with a group of woodlanders from Lilygrove. But alas, I was separated from them in all the hullabaloo. It's wonderful to see you, Albert. You look rather put together. What for a village mouse out of the snowy woods all alone? Ah, well... A tailor can't change his stripes now, can he? But what about you, dear Sophia? I'm sorry to say you're not looking quite your best. If I overheard correctly, you are having trouble. Yes, well... Actually, Albert, we are having a bit of trouble. Just a bit. Truth is, Albert, I've been bitten by a wear it, And my shoulders... Well bit of a mess. Liam needs to scout ahead to find a route to travel upon, but he won't leave me alone. Although I can certainly take care of myself. Perhaps you might stay with Sophia while I find a proper path. I was going to suggest the very thing, my good mouse. Oh, very well then. Albert, please keep an eye on Sophia. Here, here. Now, go on, my love. Get scouting. <laughs> Let's get the scouting. <laughs> All right. Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh... Thank you for all your help, Albert. Oh, Liam, it's no trouble at all. Albert, what happened to the other lily grovers? We evacuated town as soon as the sea rats arrived. Of course, many of us got split up in the fuss of it all. But a group of us managed to cross the bay and reach Old Moss Creek together. What was the plan once you reached Old Moss Creek? Continue to Red Wall? Well, I may have mentioned. We hoped to take shelter in Camp Silversands, that old mole mine. That's quite a long ways from Lilygrove. I'm not so old yet that I'm not able to make the trip up Old Moss Creek, Liam. You won't be young forever either, don't forget. Albert, what happened? We evacuated town. Oh, yeah, sure. What happened to separate you all? Oh, old Columbine kept barking out orders to us all. You know how she is. So, I was off collecting some mushrooms when a horde of rats passed by. I hid in a nearby tree and, well, once I came down, I couldn't find near the mice again. Did you by chance notice which direction the rats were headed? North. A massive, grouchy-looking rat was leading them. I heard him talking to a doe at his side. Something about a key. A massive rat. You don't mean scum snout. No, not to wear it. Just a regular rat. But very tall and wide. Well, I hope they're long gone by now. Did you say a key? What kind of key? I don't know. But I got the sense that the rats didn't quite know either. I wonder if it was the tangum. The what? Oh, nothing. Sorry. Just... Something Robin mentioned. 
Alright. And I'm quite sure Sophia will be fine. But we should just have a quick What's chat. Matter, Liam? Well, are you sure about traveling with Albert? <coughs> of course we can't just leave him behind. But what if we're putting him at more risk? That's ridiculous, Liam. He's safer with us than alone. I suppose you're right. I just feel a bit overwhelmed with all these mice in my care. Liam, darling, you are strong and capable. I don't doubt you for a single moment. Ah, of course. Scout on, dear. So I feel her pride might have been uh, hurt. With... <coughs> Yeah, I feel her pride might have been a little hurt, because she's the only one that's been wounded. What the hell is this? Oh well, uh, let's go back. Something is gonna happen soon, won't there? Oh, there he is. They know, what the hell is that? Oh. Winter shunt, eh? No, that's not. I'm gonna have to check this up for a second playthrough. Uh, I know I need to f get to the others, or I need to understand. Uh, no, I need to get. I need to understand this one to get the uh, others. Start. There are so many houses! Who all used to live out here? These shacks must be older than Lilligrove itself! Maybe it's old Lilligrove, who knows? Does someone still come out here to go fishing? Supplies from Redwall? Redwall is a supply center? And who are you, my little shop? Or what? Who? Fuck are you? Is that Liam Rivermouse? What in the name of Martin are you doing all the way out here? Well, I suppose I could ask the same of you, Mr. Star Thistle. Well, I oh, suppose him. so. But once those rats invaded my study back in the Lily Grove catacombs, I didn't have much choice but to leave while I still had my skin. Who's going to treasure the history of this world if not for me, eh? Speaking of treasure, you didn't happen to find my Star Thistle family amulet on your journey, did you? Star Thistle family amulet? I don't think so. I hid the amulet a while back along with a trail of riddles to find it again. I found the chef. It's so valuable, I can't leave it out in my study in case someone loots it like those blasted vermin did. But now that the rats it. have invaded our home, I'm worried sick one of them may find it. I'm sure I'm just being paranoid, but if you happen back to Lilygrove and come across one of my riddles, please do keep it safe, won't you? You could use it in the meantime. I bet it'd be rather helpful for a scout on the road. When you wear it, it helps your sniffer sniff better by letting you use active scent while moving. Oh, it certainly oh, wow. would help a bunch. But 
It's all the way back in Lily Grove. Aye, so you'd have to go back to find it. Maybe even back in time. Back in time? Uh, yeah, yes, I, I'm not sure how you'll do that, though. While you're here, do you think you might do me a favor? I've been trying to figure out how to get to that chest up on the ledge over there all day, and, well, I do believe your scout climbing skills are a bit more capable than mine. Might you be willing to fetch what's inside it for me? I've got a feeling it's something quite valuable. I certainly can, Mr. Star Thistle. Do you know what's inside? Aye! A short ways back, I encountered a torn piece of a journal in a chest that looked just like that one up there. This journal, you see, belonged to Gingiver Green Eyes. You do know who that is, don't you? Gingiver Green Eyes? Uh, it sounds familiar. Gingiver Green Eyes was the brother of the cruel and ruthless Queen Zarmina. Zarmina was the infamous ruler of Kotir, a fortress located where Redwall now is, during the time of Martin the Warrior. Zarmina locked Gingiver in her dungeon to rot after accusing him of murdering their father, a crime she herself had committed with the help of a traitorous fox for Chunotta. I believe Gingiver's journal will prove fascinating in telling this incredible story through Gingiver's own eyes. Please, if you could get me the journal from that chest, I would certainly reward you. Care to chat before I go, Mr. Star Thistle? Well, all right. What is it? What did you say that amulet does again? If you wear the amulet, it allows you to use active scent while moving. Quite a powerful skill for a scout, I would think. And I've got to go back to Lily Grove in order to get it? Well, that's where it's hidden. At the end of a trail of riddles. I'd tell you where straight out if I could, but sure. to be honest, I'm not sure I remember exactly where I've left it. Uh, but that's what the riddles are for. Uh, you'd have to find them first, one by one, but then they'd lead you right to the amulet. Right. Although, I can't go back to Lily Grove now. I actually found the chest first before found the finding the riddle. Oh, well, okay then. Uh, do farewell on your travels, Mr. Rivermouse. So, uh, yeah. So, what he wants me to do is. That does not look safe. I thought that guy was dead, by the way, you know. Oh well, um... Uh, that's a rat down there. Can you uh, tra -la 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 over there while I was? There's a way. There's a lot of weird scent over here. Ah, ah, okay. Interesting. Oof. Okay, sorry. I actually don't see where this chest it is. <coughs> oh, come on, you. I just need to get around and see the bits. Okay, so it's clearly not there.
<laughs> Why does the ground sound like fucking planks about to give way? <laughs> ah, smoke, smoke, okay. So finally we lay away here. Over here. Probably shouldn't focus too much on it and just try and get along. But the hell is that? Hmm. Let's check what that is first. Oh god. I picked this up. Never mind, I, I did pick this up already. Um, I don't know where that book was the book. What it now said. They are talking to each other. I do hope so, young scout. I would be devastated. Alright, let's see if the uh, go and if I remember where it was. I can figure that out on my own. And with on my own I mean when I'm playing with myself. And with playing with myself I mean not recording, so uh, you know. Right, so that's a uh, rat. Sea rat further up. Up here, you two. We can cross using this rope. Good idea. Albert? These old bones can handle that much, my good mouse. <laughs> and they are. Already up there. Cool. Rats! Quick! Everyone down! I'll find a safe way through. Okay, so the wind is blowing this way. You should have checked the bridge first. I want that. Don't 
I'm pretty sure they're gonna catch me, but you know, if I can. We're doing our best, Whip Rider. What? My paws are sore. Before I should hide myself. How these even fall through the bridge? Ain't bridges supposed to be, you know, holding stuff? Well, I think the wood was weak, which caused it to break under the weight of the... That don't make a lick of sense. Let them come and go again just to make sure. Oh, and you gotta be burned. Oh my god. You gotta be burning your, your face there, buddy. Something else. Fish and something else. Oh, my. You should have checked the bridge first. Been hidden. We're doing our best, Whip Rider. What? My paws are sore. How these even fall through the bridge? Ain't bridges supposed to be, you know, holding stuff? Poorly built a bridge. I mean, what the fuck? Oh, come on. This is ridiculous now. It wasn't me. It was, uh, it, it was too frit. My fault. It wasn't strong enough. Quit making excuses. You should have checked the bridge first. Well, you never checked the bridge first. Well, you're what the fuck? Who is seeing me? Okay, they sense me. It wasn't me. It was, uh, it, it was too frit. Oh, yeah, I forgot this one. There we go. Ah, uh, the simple mistakes are the fucking most annoying is. We're doing our best, Whip Rider. What? My paws are sore. How these even fall through the bridge? Ain't bridges supposed to be, you know, holding stuff? Well, I think the wood was weak, which caused it to break. Okay, so the moment I leave. It wasn't me, it was a. Uh, so, how the hell did I get there last time? Which wasn't strong enough. Quit making excuses, you should have checked the bridge first. Wait, didn't I go behind this guy? I think I did. I think I did. Oh yeah, I went over there and then took this. Short term memory is not a strong point on this guy. How these even fall through the bridge? Ain't bridges supposed to be, you know, holding stuff? 
Well, I think the wood was weak, which caused it to break under the weight of the... That don't make a lick of sense. It looks kind of half rotten. Yeah, it looks like no one's been tending to this sh this bridge for a while. Okay, and then I need to get up somehow. Ah, it's that blue stuff that smells, okay. To jump on that, I think. And the game is kind enough to let me know where to go. Ah. But hold on. I can't really jump on here, can I? No, I can't. So, okay, this is gonna take our seat. It wasn't me. It was, uh, it, it was too frick. Not my fault. The bridge wasn't strong enough. <clears throat> Quit making excuses. You should have checked the bridge first. I was a scene, by the way. The actual hell. How these even fall through the bridge? Ain't bridges supposed to be, you know, holding stuff? <laughs> well, I think the wood was weak, which caused it to break under the weight of the impact that make a lick of sense. Yeah, how the hell would he has something in his hair? Okay. Ah, bone, okay. Shouldn't really move just yet. Or should I? I probably should have moved. This is gonna take a while. Okay, now he's staring at me like in my face. Smoke coming. I highly doubt it is up here I shall go. But, you know, I can't get over here. What? If anything, I was hurt. It wasn't me. It was, uh... It, it was too free. It wasn't strong enough. Quit making excuses. You should have checked the bridge first. Why never check the bridge first? <laughs> Quit your squabbling. No one wants to hear about your babes crying all day. <clears throat> Sound like a little mouser. Is that what you are? A little mouser. Even fall through the bridge. Ain't 
bridge is supposed to be, you know, holding stuff. Well, I think the wood was weak, which caused it to break under the weight of the... That don't make a lick of sense. What is it that... It wasn't me. It was, uh... It, it was too for it. Not my fault. The bridge wasn't strong enough. Quit making excuses. You should have checked the bridge first. Well, you never check the bridge first. <laughs> Quit your squabbling. No one wants to hear a bunch of babes crying all day. We're doing our best with God. Your paws are sore. Oh. Okay, so the moment I stepped foot inside of that bush, I was seen. It wasn't me. It was, uh, it, it was too brief. My fault. It wasn't strong enough. Quit making excuses. You should have checked the bridge first. Oh, you never checked the bridge first. Oh, quit your squabbling. No one wants to hear a bunch of babes crying all day. Your paws are sore. Oh, 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 you sound like a little mouser. Is that what you are? A little mouser? How did these even fall through the bridge? Ain't bridges supposed to be, you know, holding stuff? Well, I think the wood was weak, which caused it to break under the weight. Well, I'm stupid. I think. Yeah, I am. I'm stupid. I don't. I don't look, I don't observe. Right, but still, what the fu- uh, Well, how could... In game logic. I mean, it's funny because I can get here. Then they're like, out of seeing me. <coughs> what to, you know, say say about that, so, uh, you know. Do I keep on sneaking this way? I won't be able to get anywhere, can I? Hello. Mole invitation, eh? We can probably either jump up here all the time. No, we can't. Darn it. There we are. Now what? Ah, there. Where did your mum get mouser bones? Mum raised me a pillager. He's pillaging those mouse bones. Yeah, right. I know your mum raised you in that horde of softies. Rat soft as bunny fur. My fur ain't soft. It's real greasy, though. It's just how daisy likes it. Don't make me vomit at my lunch. Hmm. <coughs> ah, chest. I ain't gonna bother. Now what? Yeah, n now what? What's that? See? Okay, oh, cool. So I can't go that way.
went almost. But I guess this is not how you're meant to do it. Those rats' heads, and they hadn't a clue. Amazing, eh? What's the matter, Liam? How are you feeling, Soph? Better? Worse? Actually, that poultice you made has me feeling quite all right. Although, I admit my fever is still making me a bit woozy. But I'm sure Albert can help us get to the Winsome Wraith quick as a weevil on rye. Let's just get as far as we can today before making camp for the night. Ah, oh, of course. Thank you for all your help. No, oh, Liam. It's no trouble at all. Oops, sorry. Are they still down there, these? Yep, they are. Don't mind me. Oh, these waterfalls are beautiful. I'll have to bring Sophia here in the summer. When things are calmer. I bet that barley mill is older than Martin himself. I can't believe it's still turning. There's a cave back there in the rock. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, there. Where, where does this bridge go to anyway? Actual hell. <laughs> I mean, it goes like that way, sort of, but... I think I've seen everything I can. Whoops, shit. Hmm. Liam Rivermouse? Oh. Is that you? Hi, Miss Ivy Wayne. How are you? I didn't expect to see you out here. In the snow. Well, what do you expect? Those blasted vermin forced us out of our homes and into this cold to live like cave mice. I am positively shivering my tail off. You did say you were a scout now, didn't you? Yes, I am a scout. Just as of last night, actually. Then why don't you do your scoutly duties and fetch me something warm, hmm? I did see some cattails around here. They're good for sewing mittens. Uh, perhaps three should do the job. Oh, I can certainly help. I'll be here, counting my toes until they turn blue. You know, I think... I'll be back with some cattails. I think... Because I did have up to, uh, you know, silver here. I think I have to install the first game or the Act 1 again in order to get this, these bonuses. <coughs> uh, these two you actually save from the catacombs, so, uh, you know. I have to see that I made it out somehow. Hello there! Greetings, Miss Ivy Wayne! Liam, <laughs> please! How many times do I have to tell you? Call me Belladora. Now, what on earth are you doing up Old Moss Creek? I've got to get Sophia to the Winsome Wraith, where a healer is going to look after her. She was bit by that wearette at Lilygrove. A wretched scum snout. Oh, no. I've seen scum snout. That monster has caused us all quite the trouble, hasn't he? Dorabella and I are trying to get to Redwall, but... The journey is proving more tiring than I expected. Thank goodness we have Ichabod with us. I don't know what we'd do without him. 
I'm certainly glad you're all together out here. Actually, Ichabod went ahead a while ago. He insisted on finding the ingredients for a campfire dinner as splendid as one we'd have back at home. He really is a sweetheart, isn't he? I'm just worried that it'll be cold out there. It really is getting chilly. I don't suppose... Well, if you happen to see him, do you think you could give him my scarf? I don't want him to catch a chill. Oh, it would be my pleasure, Belladora. I'll give it to him right away. Oh, thank you, Liam. Stay warm out there, all right? Safe travels. Ishabon is out there too. Hey, so there you are. What's the matter? Oh, nothing's the matter. I just wanted to tell you. Okay, so. I could be a fool. Hi. You know, it's fun that the guy we were talking about, you know, in whatever it now was, showed up like 10 seconds later. Uh, I think I'm gonna stop here though, you know, get the... Uh, <clears throat> sure. <laughs> what am I doing here? Smoke, Alpalodora. Alright, so I think I'm gonna stop it right here and uh, thank you all for watching and uh, see you all next time.